a newer area of study, one we've uh, wrestled with for a long time. This is the area of cancer cachexia um, and what is what we would call muscle wasting or sarcopenia, loss of muscle mass. So we know that uh, cancer can be a wasting uh, illness due to the increased metabolic demands of the cancer on the patient. We complicate that with our treatments which cause further uh, lack of appetite, loss of weight, uh, and muscle wasting. And these factors of weight loss and muscle wasting are integrally related but not always the same, meaning that we're learning now that even patients who don't look as if they're severely malnourished or have lost a lot of weight still have significant loss of muscle mass. And this can happen at the beginning of therapy, even before treatment from the cancer itself. So patients even with a large body mass index or who look to be, quote, well nourished, when you actually measure muscle, uh, have a significant loss uh, uh, of muscle mass. And therefore, that contributes to the factors we often uh, see as problems in management of our patients, that is fatigue, fall in performance status, uh, less energy, inability to work, inability to carry on activities of daily living. So these are major problems for our patients with, uh, with cancer and cancer treatment. And to date, we've not had effective regimens to really manage those. Uh, but interestingly now, there are a host of agents that are starting clinical trials that by one way or another uh, attack this problem. One is a ghrelin uh, agonist, which uh, actually may have some effect uh, centrally in stimulating appetite and therefore causing uh, weight gain in ways that may be safer than uh, regimens like steroids and other things that have been used in the past. Uh, and the other is a novel uh, class of compounds known as SARMs, Selective Androgen Receptor Modulators. Uh, the first in class is a drug called Enobosarm. Uh, and like the ghrelin agonist, both of these trials are in, currently in phase three studies uh, against control to show uh, whether or not there will, there will be benefit.